you know, we get intense with each other about stuff because we care about it and because we know what each other. Hold on a second. Hollywood's calling. Uh, that's a lie. This is a lie detector. <laughs> <laughs> First thing I liked about my spouse, well, I fell in love with my wife the second I saw her. I was like, we're done. This is it. And then the stalking began. <laughs> he made me laugh in a way that felt very comfortable and familiar, but also kind of new and exciting. And I had not experienced that with anyone before. I thought she was very attractive. <laughs> I mean, if I'm going to yeah, be honest, like guys versus girls. that's the first thing as soon as I saw her, I was like, oh, that girl's really pretty. <laughs> the best day of my marriage. That's a good question. You could go straight to having a baby, yeah. right? That would be a good one, but then I have two So babies. which day, yeah. So think. which baby's better? I mean, I guess it's equal. I think our wedding day was quite nice. I will say our wedding day, the first one where we went to like City Hall and got married, yeah. there were all kinds of couples there, like, you know, people were pregnant, everybody was talking, it there was were, great. People were selling flowers. I still have my bouquet from that. Yeah. There were people selling was everyone flowers. pregnant? Every Literally, <laughs> everybody but us. Hundreds of people. It was interesting. <laughs> they divided it like pregnant or recent death scare. Yeah. <laughs> That's like the two lines you got yeah, divided into. or <laughs> interracial. <Yeah>. Mommy. <laughs> I mean, question. I thought that lie detector thing was very <laughs> funny. Was really I was funny. like, do you have that in your pocket? Is that like a go-to joke you do? Is that like Leslie Nielsen's fart machine? Yeah. <laughs> All the time. That's the thing we've done. All the time. Well, I went on a double date in high school. My first like blind date at the Chinese restaurant, I went to like cut something, but by pushing down on my fork and it catapulted the plate in the air and all the food went on my lap. Oh. And I had to put the plate underneath my legs to wipe <laughs> the food back onto the plate. And then you ate it? Well, not only did I eat it, but nobody laughed. Oh, no, that is it, it didn't even turn into comedy. We went to see the movie Hannibal. Yeah, sexy. Which, which is a very, very violent movie. But there's a part where he cuts someone's brains out while they're alive and cooks Ray them. Ray Liotta? Spoiler! Them. Yeah, spoiler alert. <laughs> Don't go on a first date to that movie. I had a date that was a few days before Valentine's Day with a guy I'd been with for quite some time. And we were eating at like some random restaurant. And he goes, oh, I'm busy on Valentine's Day, so this is Valentine's Day. And I went, okay. <laughs> and then we went and saw About Schmidt, which is one of the saddest <laughs> movies that you can see on a date. And I thought, this can't be my life. <laughs> 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 That's it.